We'll see the Varsity Girls game, weather permitting, at 7 o'clock. As this one is worked back towards Dylan Parkinson, the junior goalkeeper makes a mistake to score. White Bear Lake on the board, one to nothing. Well, Gavin Rogers does exactly what Gavin Rogers has the capability to do. When I talked in White Bear Lake, everybody spoke so well about Gavin Rogers' ability in the attacking third, and he made the goaltender pay there. That was a lazy clearance by the goaltender, Parkinson, and credit Rogers for being right there to scoop that ball up and put it past him. Looking to keep his knees intact as he tried to get through two. He was unsuccessful in doing that as it goes back to midfield. Here comes White Bear Lake. Two on one if they want it. Now a two on oh breakout. Shot from inside the box leads to a White Bear Lake goal and a two nil lead. This whole rush leading to Gavin Rogers' second goal tonight starts with a Nicky O'Brien play back on the defensive line. Just on the outside edge of the 18, a well-timed foot starts that counterattack. It goes from O'Brien to ball and a perfect through ball. Up ahead for Gavin Rogers, and Rogers does what he does best. He turns on the Jets, he gets into a one-on-one -on -one situation. Yes, he had ball chasing back for the rebound as well. But just like he did in the first game, or in the first half, Parkinson, he beat him, Parkinson, with a low shot to the left side. He did that at the exact same time here and gives the Bears potentially a decisive second goal. White Bear was given nothing inside the six. Perfectly defensive by White Bear. Corner, far post, same song, same verse. 0 for 8 now are the Raptors on corners. The execution just hasn't been there, but it is now. And Eastridge on the board. Waste management opportunity finally comes the Raptors' way, and it is 2-1. Still in favor of White Bear Lake, 14.45 left to play. So, time of the goal, 65.15. If you're the Raptors, you gotta push Parkinson up in the attacking third here. Go for the, at least go for the time. Pull, pull yourself level here. Johnston, far post, score! Waiting to see who scored the goal for Eastridge, but it is a tie game. 